I, I'm so sorry, Mr. Shelby. I'm Grace, by the way. I know who you are. What's his name? He was another name. Poor boy deserves a name. You have something to say to me? The other night she came into the pub when I was singing. She said singing wasn't allowed. I'd like there to be one night a week when they're singing. I think it would be good for everyone. Saturday nights. Harry was too afraid to ask you, so. But you're not. I am. But I love to sing. You sound like one of those rich girls who comes over from Dublin for the races. Do you like horses? How's your fancy earning some extra money? Doing what? <sighs> Dig out a nice dress. Want to take you to the races? I am the captain of my pain. My cup is empty and I haven't got a penny. But I'm buying no more whiskey. Place, Just give me a drink. <coughs> Shall I leave you alone? Came here for company. Where's Harry? He took the night off. We went to the pictures. How's your beautiful horse? I just put a bullet in his head. Was he lame? He looked at me the wrong way. It's not a good idea to look at Tommy Shelby the wrong way. What a waste. Yeah, a waste is what it is. You know, in France, In France, I got used to seeing men die. Never got used to seeing horses die. They die badly. I don't get a dress like you asked. Thanks. It's Cheltenham you're talking about. Cheltenham's grand affair, is it not? The king will be there. King George? Nope. King Billy Kimber and all his men. What must I do? For two pounds, you'll do what I ask you to do. I want three. <laughs> if I am meeting a king, I won't be wearing a cheap dress. And I asked you to let me sing. It's part of the deal now, too. Since when? Since you nearly smiled. Saturday nights, open and easy. Everyone gets to sing their song just like we did in Dublin. You never worked in Dublin. So don't lie to me. I asked around about that pub you said you used to work in. My friends over there. No one has heard of you. My guess is you had a girl from a good family who got herself pregnant. It's not something I want known. 
And bringing a child into the world alone ruins your life. What? Right. So I'm right. And Polly is wrong. Right about what? It doesn't matter. Looks like it matters to you. Family business. You won't tell anyone my secret. Do you think I tell people things? So what do you sing? Anything you want. Right. Get up on the chair. Okay. Happy or sad? Sad. Okay. But I warn you, I'll break your heart. Already broken. In a neat little town they call Belfast Apprentice to trade I was bound Many an hour sweet happiness Had I spent in that neat little town A sad misfortune came over me which caused me to stray from the land Far away from my friends and relations Betrayed by the black velvet band Her eyes, they shone like diamonds I thought her the queen of the land And her hair hung over her shoulder Tied up with a black velvet band Epiphim. Did you want whiskey as well? No, just beer. Why well, not whiskey time? You're expecting trouble. Jesus Christ, Tommy. What the hell made you get them sink? They saw what they're strangling cats out there. All right, twenty's the plate. Come on. <laughs> and what did make you change your mind, though, Tommy? Hmm? Yeah, I mean, it's about time, Tommy. Time for what? <clears throat> Tommy took yourself a woman. Just play the bloody hands. <laughs> you stay the way you are, Tommy. Remember what Dad used to say. Fast women and slow horses will ruin, ruin your, your life. life. <laughs> you go on. But Mr. Fenton said... Let's go on. I've never approved of women in pubs, but when they look like that... He says you wanted men called Shelby. You've got three of them. <laughs> 